Well, hey everybody, welcome to another Nut Thursday in New Hampshire. You're either here because you're a flashaholic, you're curious about this light, or you just like to watch Nut Thursday videos. So here's the deal. Our friends at Through Night sent me a new flashlight to show you. This is not a review, it's an overview. Only because I've only had it a short period of time, I'm just going to show you this light, what it does, all about it. Uh, as to the review end, well, you know, I haven't had it long enough, but I do own enough through night flashlights to say that I have been pleased with them. So, with that, let's introduce the TT20. So, this is a large 21700 battery flashlight. It's geared as a tactical flashlight, which means it's set up in certain ways, certain modes, but in reality, most people just EDC them. They carry them, but what makes it tactical is like the crenulated bezel, the turbo on the tail cap switch, high power, bright. Before I go showing you more of this, I want to show you, I immediately, the night I got it, took it outside and had to see how bright the turbo was. Real bright, nice beam. That is 2,526 lumens. So it does a great job of, you know, lighting up everything. So initially, just putting it in hand, it's a very comfortable light. This is my preferred size light, the 21700 battery. I just like the way they feel in hand. I can get a good grip on them. And also with that size battery, well, it lasts a long time. So let me point out immediately the things that Through Night always does right and why I own several of them, a lot of them actually. One is their buttons. You hear that? I love that because it's responsive. It's not mushy like some of the rubber buttons on some of the flashlights I own. The big thing that Through Night does right and it's actually my favorite feature on most through nights. It's got a beautiful tail cap switch and is tail cap standable. That is a huge plus because this actually does have a moonlight mode. So you're at home and at night and you just want to keep it like that or on any other lower settings you can use it as a lantern so button wise I always like the way through nights are set up so in short what you get in the box is the obvious flashlight with battery you get a holster you get literature you get a through night lanyard and a USB-C cable so this doesn't operate like a lot of lights where when you turn it on, you press repeatedly the side switch to cycle through different power settings, mode settings. This is what they call infinity. So essentially, you hit the side switch, you press and hold, see it dimming, it bottoms out, goes all the way to the high. And with that, we find a comfortable spot, click it off. When you go back, the memory memorizes where it was on your setting, your preferred setting. So that's kind of cool. And with that, what that gives you is that gives you the option of your side switch giving you your memory where you set it. Long press and hold. You go to moonlight. Tail cap switch is turbo only. So with that or the strobe, one, two, three, you can immediately get to four different settings 
through one step. That is great. I love the fact that you can always get to a moonlight mode. Sorry, it's daylight. And the turbo independently without having to cycle through. So obviously you want to see some nighttime footage, so that's what we're going to roll. As I tell you about what the settings are, as I stated, turbo is 2,526 lumens. Uh, that goes down to 610 lumens after 150 seconds. Then it will sit at that 610 for 237 minutes. Your strobe is at 1,294 lumens. That'll run for 320 minutes. Now your infinity, the press and hold, and it cycles through from high to low, low to high. Your infinity lowest is 31 lumens. That's perfect. That will run for 90 hours straight. Max beam distance is 258 meters. Max, it is waterproof to IPX8 standard, which is two meters. Impact resistance at 1.5 meters. And again, ergonomically, it's set up very well. Now, what is cool is it is a two-way clip. I like to run it this way. I don't put this in my pocket uh, or any other one. I usually make some type of holster or sheath. But the thing that I like about that is when you stand it like this, you can actually have the beam up off of the surface so you can do things. But the beautiful thing is if that's not your preference, two-way clip so you can go deep pocket and you can run it lens down and that is a nice option it's not terribly tight but it does work and then the light is also USB-C rechargeable from outside of the light now the battery in this is great it's awesome it's huge but you have to charge it through the flashlight. You cannot take it out, remove it, and put it in a standalone charger because of the way it's set up. That's just the nature of things these days. If you want these lights to do the things that they do, well, the companies have to make them a certain way, you know, to work as we're finding. And that's fine with me. The light does what it does. The battery has to be that way. I'm used to it. Again, very comfortable. It weighs in at 6.4 ounces with the battery. It is very similar to my PD36R in size. They wanted me to do a comparison, but I'm only going to show you, you know, size-wise comparison. Obviously, the lumens on this are far more than that. So realistically, in my opinion, you can't compare them. They're not the same but they are in the same class of lights, which is 21700. So let me just recap before we go. And one other feature that I wanna point out. So you press and hold, it goes to moonlight, press and hold again. You are now locked out from the side switch 
and the tail cap switch. Priceless. So I really like this light and I've stated in a video recently that the TN12 TC12 has been a favorite light of mine. This is like that, but better because it's bigger, it's brighter, and it meets the things that I want personally, you may be different, in a light that I carry. That is moonlight, tail cap standable, direct access to turbo, direct access to moonlight, and I really like that I can set this where I want it. So for daytime use, if I'm out digging, like right there, perfect. If I need to look at something, take a picture, and that's it. It's set at my memory. Also with the dual clip and large battery, yeah, nice flashlight. I like it, and uh, I hope the video helps you. Obviously you came here looking for flashlights or not looking for flashlights, but it may tickle your fancy. Either way, I appreciate you stopping by and watching. I will see you all very soon. Until next time, enjoy your not Thursday. Thursday.